Welcome to Stress and Intonation channel. Today we are going to talk about would, an auxiliary verb, a modal auxiliary verb. We use would mainly to talk about the past, talk about the future in the past, express the conditional mood. Also use would for other function, functions such as expressing desire, polite requests and questions, opinion or hope, wish and regret. Now let's talk about the structure of would. The basic structure for would is subject plus auxiliary verb would plus main verb. Note that the auxiliary verb would is invariable. There is only one form, would. The main verb is usually in the base form, like he would go. The use of would, would for the past. We often use would as a kind of past tense of will or going to. Even as a boy, he knew that he would succeed in life. I thought it would rain, so I brought my umbrella. Using would as a kind of past tense a will or going to is common in reported speech. Like, she said that she would buy some eggs. I'll buy some eggs. The candidate said that he wouldn't increase taxes. I won't increase taxes. Why didn't you bring your umbrella? I told you it would rain. It's going to rain. We often use would not to talk about past refusals. He wanted a divorce, but his wife would not agree. Yesterday morning, the car wouldn't start. We sometimes use would rather like used to when talking about habitual past behavior. Remember, behavior. And hobbies. Like every weekend my father would come home from work at 6 p.m. and watch TV. Every summer we'd go to the seaside. Sometimes she'd phone me in the middle of the night. We would always argue. We could never agree. Would for the future in the past. When talking about the past, we can use would to express something that has not happened at the time we are talking about. In London, she met the man that she would one day marry. He left five minutes late, unaware that the delay would save his life. Would for desire or inclination. I'd love to leave here. Would you like some coffee? What I'd really like is some tea. Would for polite requests and questions. Would you open the door, please? More polite then. Open the door, please. Would you go with me? More polite than. Will you go with me? Would you know the answer? More polite than, do you know the answer? What would the capital of Nigeria be? More polite than, what is the capital of Nigeria? Would for opinion or hope? I would imagine that they'll buy a new one. 
I suppose some people would call it torture. I would have to agree. I would expect him to come. Since you ask me, I'd say the blue one is best. Would for wish. I wish you would stay. I really want you to stay. I hope you will stay. They don't like me. I'm sure they wish I'd resign. Would for presumption or expectation. That would be joke calling. I'll answer it. We saw a police helicopter overhead yesterday morning. Really, they would have been looking for those bank robbers. Would for uncertainty. He would seem to be getting better. Less certain than he seems to be getting better. I would appear that I was right. Less certain that it appears that I was right. Would for derogatory or disrespectful comment. They would say that, wouldn't they? John said he didn't steal the money. Well, he would, wouldn't he? I have to repeat again that we use used to and will for the past, but we use would only for habits and hobbies. For example, I would live in London doesn't mean I used to live in London. It is different. Thank you very much for watching and do not forget to subscribe the channel. Bye.